Hi, I'm Megan. Today we're going to perform an ear cleaning on this dog. Now the doctor has already taken a look at these ears and we've made sure that the eardrum is intact and that is important when it comes to choosing the type of cleaner that we're going to use. If the eardrum is not intact, you want to use just saline solution so that you don't get anything under that eardrum that's going to cause problems. His eardrum is intact, so we're going to use a commercial ear cleaner. What I will do is start by lifting the ear and I'm just going to squeeze a little bit of this down into his ear canal. It doesn't need to be too much. At the base of the ear, I'm just going to start squishing that around. And what this is going to do is loosen up that waxy debris that's in there and make it easier for us to remove it. I like to use cotton balls. Gauze sometimes on this delicate ear tissue can cause a little bit of bleeding. So just as far as I can stick my finger in there, I'm going to put the cotton ball down there and I'm just going to start removing some of that brown gook that's in there. This usually feels pretty good. We haven't seen any blood in here. So most of this is just really itchy and it feels good to, to get rid of that debris that's in there. So he seems to be enjoying this a little bit, which is great. It's important not to forget, you know, the folds in this outer ear as well. Kind of get all of that clean. Things are feeling a little bit dry, so I'm just going to put a little bit more down there. Again, you don't need to dump half a bottle in there. A small amount goes a long way. When I start to see less debris on the cotton balls, I will use a cotton tip applicator to get down there. I don't like to use those a whole bunch because you can, just like with a Q-tip in your own ear, you can cause damage. So I'm careful not to push it down too far. I don't push it till it stops. I'm just kind of cleaning out some of the folds in his ear. So these cotton balls are coming out much cleaner now. So we've done a great job on this side. See if he wants to do a little shake at the end. Usually that feels pretty good to them. <laughs> so I'm done with the right side and we'll move on to the left and make sure that both of these ears are clean. But that is how we perform a basic ear cleaning.